Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. Welcome to Nike. This is one of the stocks for show plays of the day. Nike is on its way to the target, which is $90, which I said today. 100% conviction Nike was along today. Could it get to 92 or 91-ish or something else? Yes, yes, it could. Beautiful rally here. It's going to hit up over into the major versatile time, 3 o'clock, and hit the number 90. It could blow right over. This could rally up until 4 o'clock, actually. It actually could rally into the close here. What a nice chart here in Nike. This is a perfect example of institutional buying. I warned everyone in the trading room this morning. I said, do not fade this. Don't fade Nike. I knew people would look at this as a fade. And I said, please don't short this today. If anything, it's a long, and it was a long, it's a good long. This is a nice golden gap. This is a bullish gap though, okay? Why would anyone fade this? Well, because people think that stocks fill gaps, meaning that the stock, look at this, here it goes. Here, it's going to hit about over 90. Wow, look at this thing. <sighs> Nike could get up over 100 before the end of the year. That's like not even, that's like going to happen. All right, so this closed here the night before on Thursday at 79.75. Then opened this morning at 87.98. It's a $10 gap up, and then people think it's going to fill the gap. No, that was institutional buying that made that gap. That gap held today in the middle of no man's land beautifully. I know it took a while to get going, but big whoop de do it was good. Let's go over this. Actually, if you were really aggressive in this in the morning today in the one minute, it stopped you out aggressively in the morning, but then you could have retaken it, or you could have waited for the five minute or the 15 minute. I always like to do the one, though. Here is the aggressive long and Nike. Stop here. You would have gotten taken out. Again, I'm sure people shorted this. Wrong thing to do. Here's where it's set up. Here's where it's set up. I caught in the live trading room. Rallied, rallied, rallied over the high. I'm sure people tried to fade this in here and here. Why? Because it did lower highs and lower lows. But the fact is Nike was a bullish gap and it was going to hold in the sky. And it did. Look at this. This is, a, this is gorgeous. Anyways, this held. And it just took a while to get going. If you were in in the morning and couldn't be patient, you're not getting paid now. You're not getting the, this move. Here's the 15 minutes setting up. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Rally up. Oh, God, with an eight pennies. Let's see what this does. An hour left in the day, though. Let's look at it. So then it had several 15-minute buy setups in here, and you could have actually been really tight with a stop. Why? Time of the day. Time of the day. Running out of day Friday. I will say it's so unusual, though. This afternoon, this week, there's been afternoons this week I've traded. I don't. This week has had afternoon moves for some reason. Maybe it's because it's the fall. Maybe it's because it's September. Maybe it was a market this week. I don't know why. But there were afternoon moves and stuff this week, more so than I usually see. Uh, and Nike is a great example here. So I have to check with the room on Monday to see who ended up pulling this to get paid here into the afternoon because this was the payout here in Nike. And if you add in the 15-minute, you made even more. Here it goes. Here, this is going to hit over 90 now. So this is one of the stocks we'll show. Plays of the day calls in here for Nike. A beautiful bullish gap. This is a golden gap. It's a bullish gap. It's a bullish move. I know how to read bullish gaps as well as bearish gaps. It's something that I do very well. I just know when something's good, and it's because of my 26-point rating system. That's how I'm able to read these charts so well. It's how I'm able to read institutional positioning in charts. And Nike was a great example here, and I'm sure some traders, a lot of traders, try to short this today. It's the wrong thing to do, and here it is. Nike up over 90. Go. And with the market. Just gorgeous. What gorgeous, gorgeous buying here in Nike. So email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you want to sign up for the Golden Gap class. It's this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, the 27th and 28th. Deadline is today to sign up. Have a great weekend, everyone. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you want more information. Thanks.